And welcome back folks, welcome back to Let's Play Fallout. When we last left off we fixed the water pump and killed the mutants. Um, yeah, however we didn't level by doing that quest. Um, and apparently we can talk to the sewer. Oh no, we can talk to dog meat. Yeah. I thought that, yeah, for, for a moment that that was actually part of the ground, okay. So we have to um, get the water chip. And for that we need to deal with the glowing ones, which are these guys. <clears throat> and yeah, as we have been told, they do not like the presence of other people. Um, emphasis on people. Okay, he's blind. So actually, um, that means he, that he will stop attacking us. Let us try to disable him. Okay. That sort of did the trick. Uh, can't end combat right now. And he has nothing for me to steal. Okay. Uh, and where are you? Where are you going, Ian? Oh, I think this might be because Ian is still hurt. Yeah, because last time when we fought the mutants, I think that Ian was quite badly wounded. So let's deal with him. Okay. Now let's heal. Uh, first we will heal ourselves. Using our first aid skill and that... Yeah. We are heal... We healed one point. Um, which is not exactly fantastic. Okay, how bad is Ian hurt? Uh... I actually wanted to examine him, not talk to him. <laughs> he looks almost dead, okay. Uh, then I suppose that he doesn't have medkits. Um, no, he does have medkits, but he doesn't bother to heal. Anyway, okay. Uh, let us make sure that he doesn't die. By the way, how is, how is dog meat? Oh, he's also almost dead, okay. Then I will use some of my medkits to heal these people. Okay, how badly wounded is he now? Okay, severely wounded is, I think, good enough. Um, because I don't think that we will, we will meet heavy resistance. Yeah, I mean, these, these glowing ones are there quite um, easy to fight, as you just saw. Okay, let me... I should also heal myself, probably. Um... Yeah, and let me check something. Um... I wanted to see whether... Oh, it's not you, actually. I wanted to talk to Tisho. Let me see whether you actually have some 5mm jacket hollow point ammunition. No, okay. So we need to buy some so that you can use this assault rifle. Which will be much better than what Tishu is currently equipped with. Um, and there does not appear to be anything of interest here. No, okay. Let's then move on into the vault. This vault looks particularly scavenged. You think to yourself that nothing of value could possibly remain. Well, hopefully a water chip has remained. Um, OK. 
Okay, is there anything for me to steal here? It appears not. Hmm, no. Okay. Then let's move let's move on. Okay, let us move down to the second floor. There are some glowing ones. Um, I suppose that they will be aggressive, but you should always check in this game. You can't you can't be sure. Okay, he just ignores me. Okay, these ghouls seem to be passive. Um, I could attack them and gain some experience, but that would be kind of mean. Also, I'm think once we've stolen their water chip, they will get aggressive anyhow. So, and there is nothing here there for me to steal. Uh, hmm. Let's talk to these fellas here. Ah, that's more like it. Okay, and he didn't do any damage at all. Let's go for the eyes and blinded him. So let's just finish him. The other party is slowly catching up. <clears throat> Dogmeat has a lot of action points, actually. And blinded. And soon to be dead. Okay, let's again go for the eyes. And that was it. Ghoul was critically hit in the eyes for 60 hit points. The loss of an eye is too much for him and he falls to the ground. I'm not surprised. Ah, that's why there were zombie ghouls because they guarded these red X pills. These are, uh, let's read this description. Um, for some reason you can't scroll up. Okay. So, yeah. They remove radiation. Uh, or prevent, yeah. Either they remove radiation or prevent you from accumulating radiation in your body. Um, I mean, you can't accumulate radiation, but radioactive, radioactive particles, of course. You know, it begs the question how a pill could possibly remove radioactive particles from your body. Um, but I'm not going to question that logic, except that I just did. Anyway. So, yeah, there are these pills here. And these non-hostile hostile mutants. Uh, not mutants, ghouls. <clears throat> so, it appears that the zombie ghouls are aggressive while the non-zombie ghouls aren't. Um, these are just regular ones. And they ignore me. Okay. Uh, they will not ignore me for very long. Because once we've stolen the water chip, I think they might want to kill us. And that these two lockers are empty. Um, hmm. And that ghoul also just ignores me. Um, hmm. Oh. And 
It appears that they, just, the, that they have just killed a merchant. Let us see what's going on there. They thank us for fixing the water pump. Hmm. That's interesting. Okay, they are not going to comment about this dead merchant there. Hmm. Okay, let us see whether they get aggressive if we uh, remove the water chip. Um, ah, I think dog meat is blocking the way, blocking my way. Yes. And we gained a level. After shutting down the water purification computer, you can now hear the repaired water pump working in the distance, bringing water up from what must be a deep well under ne Necropolis. Ah. So actually this water is not pumped up from um, the vault, but from a water resource below, apparently. We've gained 1,500 points of experience for getting the water chip. And we now have to decide what, um, yeah, which, how to distribute our points. Yeah, by the way, we have again this champion karma. Um, so, okay, we have basically leveled um, completely. Yeah, you can only pu put it to 200, so I don't think um, investing these skill points into unarmed combat will be that useful. So we shall uh, invest actually lo a lot of this into uh, energy weapons and um, hmm. I think speech might be somewhat important. Hmm. Because it, for instance, it would have been a very useful when we had this encounter with Harry. It might, we might have been, we might have been, have had been able to avoid combat there. Um, another skill that is extremely useful is stealing, um, especially combined with sneaking. We are not very good sneaking at the moment so I'm somewhat tempted to give some points in sneaking or stealing um, I think I will actually this is wise hmm maybe I should at the moment um, yeah, it's, hmm, that's a tough decision, okay, um, I think sneaking, might at the moment be the more useful option, so we can get this to 34, hmm, Let's put this to 30 and we invest 4 points in stealing. Okay. Yeah, I think that's um, quite, um, quite sensible. He let us leave and so we, were in, we were not getting attacked by these ghouls, apparently. So if you don't fix the water pump, then they the ghouls will attack you. Um, yeah. Um, so we should now probably go back to our vault. I would say. Uh, a water purification control computer system. A water purification control computer system chip. 
looks surprisingly like the chip that your vault needs. It weighs two pounds. Um, yeah, when we come back, folks, we shall go to our vault and deliver the water purification control computer system chip. So until next time, folks, until then.